So now what I'm going to do is I'm going to take what was the very wraparound fill light and I'm going to make a spotlight by using another one of my collapsible snoots. So let's go over here and pull this guy off and throw this one on. And now we have a completely different look. When we're doing things like this, it's always a good idea to um, direct your subject to tell you when the light is uh, directly on them. Because it, uh, if it's slightly off, it's going to look weird. Is that on you now? Yeah, down. down? I th yeah. yeah. OK. So now what I've done is I've turned all the cameras on to high speed sync, which gives me the ability to take my shutter speed and my ISO to wherever I want it to go. As you'll see down here on the bottom, the shutter speed wheel, I'm taking it and I'm able to take it all the way up to 4,000th of a second, which is pretty cool. OK, so now we have a hair light on and we have one uh, snoot on. And I'll just go ahead and do one. Pretty outstanding. Now, let's do one just so I can show you how fun this would be in black and white. Go to function and then we'll go to creative style and I'll take it to monochrome, black and white. I want to give it a little bit more exposure, a little bit more headroom. There you go. And perfect. Wow. That's really cool. <laughs> nice. So that is something that really resembles, say, a Hollywood portrait glamour lighting. Simply two inexpensive flashes and two snoots.